Hi and welcome back my data enthusiast. Today on Techie Anshi, we will be deep diving into the world of Tableau to uncover a feature that's not just handy but essential for effective data visualization. If you've ever wanted to enhance your Tableau dashboard with interactive elements that provide more information at the click of the area of a chart rather than hovering over it, you are at the right place. In this tutorial, I will walk you through the steps that will help you to enable a tooltip when you click on a particular area of a chart rather than hovering over that same area. Now, turning your static visualizations into a dynamic one with an engaging experience is what you will uncover in this video. So without further ado, let's get right into this video tutorial. Let's look at our sample superstore dashboard. Now, if I look at this particular geo map, when I hover on a particular area, I can see the different states and then the various profit ratios with respect to it. Now I want to show this not on hover over, but on click. So I'll just go to this particular sheet and I'll go ahead and unhide it. And I'll also unhide the tooltip sheet, which is associated with it, where you can see the profit ratios by various cities. Now, I have to create a few calculated fields. Okay, the first one is zero and it's a simple zero number that you'll enter here. Similarly, the second one would be one where you'll enter numeric one. So these are the two that we have created. And then we will also go ahead and create a parameter. This parameter we will call as zero or one. And it's going to be a parameter that is going to take integer values. Let's give it a list and put zero and one values over here. Click on OK. So we now have two calculated fields zero and one and one parameter zero one. Now I will go ahead and uh, pull the zero and one these two calculation that we created into the details shelf and go ahead right click and change this to an attribute instead of sum. Okay, for both of them. So once you change it to an attribute, you can see this is how it will look. Now let's navigate to the tooltip profit ratio by city, this chart. Here I'm going to create another calculated field, which I will call as show hide the tooltip. Now this is going to take in the value from the parameter that we created. So if the zero one parameter is equal to one, then we are going to uh, set this to true else we are going to set this to false and we'll end this particular calculation over here click on ok now you can see the calculation is created i will go ahead and add it to the filter and set the custom value list to true once you do that you can go ahead and click on ok so this will not be shown if it is set to zero it will only be shown if the value is set to one this parameter value okay so this is what is the main trick here, which will enable us to uh, show and hide this particular uh, chart. Okay. So remember, you need to have these two on the detail shelf of the chart. Okay. Now we will go to the dashboard. We will go to actions. Okay. Here in actions, we will say add action and we will say change parameter. Under the change parameter, you will go ahead and select the sheet, which is the sales map and select the parameter 01 and then we'll go ahead and select the attribute 1 here sorry attribute 0 in the source field and we leave the aggregation as sum however the run action on should be selected for the uh, hover okay and then we can keep the aggregation actually as none okay this parameter action we will just call it as 0 or you can just name it as parameter action for zero okay once done we will just put it as okay and again we will create one more change parameter this one we will call this as parameter action for one now again we will go ahead and select the map that's the one sheet now the target parameter here would be the zero one and here in we will going to select the attribute one again the aggregation has to be set to none and the run action has to be set to hover. 
as now you can clearly see that the chart is not displayed when you hover however it comes up only when you go ahead and click on that particular area so if i disable the filter here i can just click on a particular state and then see the respective city's profit ratio isn't this a very very cool feature right now you can also go ahead and update the tool tips based on what you would actually like to show right now i'm doing a few aesthetic changes here and this is totally up to you how do you want to show the tool tips uh, i'm just putting a quick note that you have to click on the state to see the profit ratio right so that the users would know so when you click on it you can see the state uh, and the cities associated to that state so with that we are able to achieve this nice and cool feature of clicking on a particular area of the chart to show the tooltip instead of showing it on the hover over i hope you liked this video and are definitely going to subscribe to my channel to see more such amazing content i will see you on the next one until then stay tuned bye bye